But yes, anyway, it's a great movie. I saw it and it was, it was, it was very good. Uh, I was pleasantly surprised. I was kind of worried given the beginning trailers with, with the sloth flash. And like in that very beginning trailer when there was a, a really dim-witted, stupid yak character that ate the, put, the sleep dart and then fell asleep. I was really worried that like the sloth and, uh, the sloth. The sloth and the yak character would like be Nick's friends and they'd be in the movie all the time like Yolof from Frozen, that stupid little snowman, but good, those characters were barely in it at all. I don't think the yak was in it at all. I think they, they, they were walking across the street and like with yaks and they were probably there. Were they yaks? I don't know what they were. All the beasts? Something stupid. But uh, yeah, I was I was pleasantly surprised. The only detractor from watching that movie was um, uh, it's Easter holiday, and I completely forgot that it was Easter holiday. And I thought to myself, hmm, you know what? It's ten past one in the afternoon. If I go and watch it now, there'll be no kids in there, or barely any kids in there. No, it's Easter holiday. Do I use quick attack instead of flamethrower? God, I'm an idiot. Um, but no, uh. Oh, for God's sake, what? Yeah, so it was just me. Uh, loads of parents and loads of children. And me. Sat in a cinema, watching a kid's Disney film. But you know, there's a difference between movies for kids and movies for everyone. It's a movie for everyone. It's my rationale and I'm sticking to it. Unfortunately, after watching the movie, you are legally obligated to ship the two main characters together. You, just, you you can't not do it. Like, it's impossible not to. And everyone's like, hey, it's my ship! It's like, no, the, the ship is practically in the movie. Like, you can almost see it from the first time the two characters meet. You're sort of like, yeah, everyone's gonna ship these two. There's, there's no way they're not. <laughs> All healed. Do I have any... Oh man, I need some, like, potions and stuff. Yeah, well... Oh! He wasn't even facing me! Did you see- He wasn't even facing- He was facing down! Just so he went... You! <laughs> I'm outraged! <laughs> I'm outraged! <coughs> and I got a sore throat. Okay, three body slams. Unless you disable body slam. Okay, sing. That's okay. That's fine. That's fine. Even though Pavinda's beautiful singing voice, Lapras! I have a tiny little water gun. Yeah! That's what you get for having a bath. Yeah, we can keep going with this. More, more body slams. I can't believe that. It's basically, I'm having all the bad luck today. All the bad luck. Don't. Come on, I've already got something to say, but haven't I? Oh. Did, did I become undisabled at some point? Oh, another paralysis. How do you paralyze slime? Ah, more water gun. Oh no, I can't. <laughs> I forgot my weakest attack was out of commission. I'm cheering up now. There's only one thing that can sour my day. And we all know what that is. Because I keep talking about it and I won't let it go. I will never let it go. Easy peasy. Another Grimer, okay. We'll just keep body slamming these Grimers until they go away. Disable no more! Yes! Can have a water gun, finish you off with water. Grimer looks a bit derpy, so like. Eh. Good to see I was kind of crossing my eyes there. 
don't make me mad. Don't make you mad. You can just you were over here facing down. Outrageous. Okay, this is the last guy, and then I'm going to go and heal. No, I'm going to heal this way. It's really why weird because it's in reverse. Uh, I'm going to heal this way, and uh, I'm going to see if the sound's recorded, and if it's not, then I'm just going to be really pissed off. It's beautiful. You just see me happy and smiley in this video, but um, I won't be happy and smiley. I can't believe I caught that Snorlax in one Pokeball. I mean, should I count that? Because I... I... It's self-inflicted technical issues, isn't it? Like, I could have sped that up and then just done the same thing as last time. But... You know what, I'm gonna let it go. But it's not, it's not being released because it's dead. It's just going back to the mountains. It gets to live another day. Which is nice. It's nice for some Pokémon. Or I could keep it. Keep it in my team. Let's just get out of the dead weight. <laughs> I think I might just keep him in the box just for hilarity's sake. Hey look, there's the Pokemon I can't use. <laughs> okay, let's go back and heal. What could possibly go wrong? I will see you in a second after a jump cut, assuming the sound still works. Yay! Well, that's all sorted. Everybody's healed. The sound worked! Guys, it worked! Hopefully it's still working. Uh, I did do something incredibly unfortunate though in between. I thought, wait a minute, I can get some good TMs from the game corner, right? But I need money. I had loads of money. Unfortunately, I have half as much money as I used to have. Because, um... Yeah, look! You are supposed to go after, um... Koga 5th. I had twice as much money and I went to the game corner he sells you 50, 50 coins for a thousand, thousand pokey dollars every time you do it. And I sat there doing that for a while. I could have sworn there was a multiplier. Like you could exchange a thousand for a thousand coins or whatever. But obviously not. Okay, this is the... Uh, Sucker. There are three routes. There are three routes, and I've got a choice. I can either go through all of the routes. Because ideally, ideally, you'd fly to the top, wouldn't you? You'd fly back to the top. Ah, oh, maybe I should go get Friar. You know what? We're probably going to do the three routes. So, yes, I am going to go get Friar from the box. Oh, no, he's not in the box. I put him in the daycare center. See you at the daycare center, guys. See you at the daycare center. Uh why, why, why? <laughs> Your fries level has grown a lot. It's grown by one. Aren't I great? You owe me two hundred dollars for returning this Pokemon. Fine, here's your Pokemon. Friar is back, baby. He's back. <coughs> you know what I'm gonna do first? Hey, Friar. Look at this. It's called, get this, a flying type move. I know it's like rare and sort of, it's kind of mysterious, but you know, it's something that birds can do. Flying type moves? I thought, I thought I'd let you, you see what it's like to have one. What do you want to forget? Let's forget Razor Wind because that whole debacle was a complete disappointment. Not only does it take two turns, it's not even a flying type attack. Yes! And now Friar is at. How what level is Friar? 27. Oh, it's the same level as Pavenda. Oh, maybe like. They can be raised together! Oh. That's nice. That's sweet! There we go. Look, they're the same! Okay. Oh, I have actually put. I put Marmite in the box for now because. I'm not going to be using him for a little bit because I've got other Pokemon which are just as strong. Which need a bit more training. So, there's that. Okay, let's try this out. 
Landmark moment, guys. Friar. Use fly! Uh, where do we go to? Uh, no. Saffron, Celadon, yes! Okay, let's do this thing, baby! Uh, now I need to... Yes, let's uh, go down the bicycle road. So there are three routes. I'm going to have to take the left route, and then the middle route, and then the right route. I don't think Gary's around here, is he? I mean, lard, but... <laughs> Okay, right. Left route first! Oh no! I can't stop moving! 